content of everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, and that's the point I'm making. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Do, you, do you speak Yoruba fluently? You do. I'm not going to test you. Don't worry. I, 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 I was just interested to know. Yeah, I do. I have to. Yeah. I was taught Yoruba by my mother. Okay. Um, I lived in Nigeria. Okay. But I think the only thing that I kind of do not like is just Nigerians don't study. Right, right. You know, before you came, a brother, a Sabali brother, was just raising that exact point. He yeah. was saying that a lot of people try to. Live off Egypt, but yeah, not sorry, they're all six. Like beyond Egypt, yeah, beyond yeah. UK, be like we have knowledge about ourselves that yeah, yeah. so if we actually took the time out to understand, we would understand that we are actually, you know, intelligence here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. But there's this thing that Nigerians do, and I call it the spirit of laziness. Okay, okay, okay. Instead of you to understand who you are and the power of who you are and how you can use your like, use your power, yeah. you start complaining. Right, right. Like, complain about everything. You complain about everything, everyone, everybody in this thing, and and sort of just push the blame on them. And one thing, one thing in Nigeria, like in the Yoruba culture, is you have to respect your elders. So as a young child, I was always told to. But in it, like my uncles will be on the table having a discussion about the problems in Nigeria, and I'll be like, yeah, but why? Right. And they'll tell you, but shush. Right, right. But I will come back and still do, but why? why? Yeah, yeah, and they'll tell you, shush. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, like, if we're supposed to teach our children, when our children ask us why, if we cannot educate them, no, I agree. that's where the problem starts. I agree. And we've had, like, generations of, like, just children living, and they're not being taught about where they come from, who they are, how they need to act, what, how, like, what their power truly is. And then you sort of ship them to London and expect them to continue the legacy of a quote-unquote Yoruba. Yeah, that's true. But they were never, they never had... Can I ask a question? <coughs> the, 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 the have not wanted to share. Does, does it have anything to do with um, uh, Biafra, for example? Sometimes. Also as well, it's because everyone's in black. Right. Like they dip their hand in black. Right, right, right. So the only thing they have to teach is the black. Yeah. Do you understand what I mean when I say that? Like, and it's kind of like when, how can I say this? When you're trying to, when you're trying to cover up the truth of the things that you do, the best way to do that is to just not, not speak. speak about it. So this is why we have a lot of silent adult Yoruba walking around talking about yeah I'm proud of my country this this that 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 but when we go to your when we go and we look and when we look at what you're doing when we look at what you're teaching your children none of it speaks the essence of a Yoruba person yeah. because like they'll say Nile Yoruba like believe in that but that means with love we do things it doesn't it doesn't speak any of the stuff like you know they have parables and teachings and sayings and, and they're very like they come from a place of wisdom most of the stuff that they say, most of the wisdom, like little segments they have, none of it do they live and manifest. So it's very hard when you're like, this is who we are, but we don't practice who we are. I think that's westernization for you, in the sense of, it, it creates schizophrenia. Why is that westernization? That's black people. No, no, here I'm saying, it's it not is. Just, look, it's people. Like, as long as you've got this flesh, yeah. everyone is prone to that. To a degree. Mm -hmm. Here I'm saying, right? To a degree. I like, I'm, why, why I say that is because we've got our schizophrenia in the sense of the fact that um, yeah, we, like we've got a culture that we might love, but we've been taught that our culture is is less than that as well. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So, we're, so we're not applying our culture to, for example, we're, we're proud of our culture, but when we want government, we look to, we look to Europe to teach us how to, to do democracy. But, but we, we already have that though. That's the point I'm trying to make. Like, like uh, do, do you know the, 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 the craziest thing in all of this is, People say that the UK has the resource, the knowledge, the da, da, da. What was we talking about? How Dubai does not even have up to half, half, half of what Nigeria holds. You give, you give, you give four kings here the seat. Tell them to use their wisdom to run the country. We'll be fine in a week. That I, I'll put my in a week. We'll be fine because I know. In Nigeria, if you tell someone, build me a house, they can do it, yeah, yeah. you know what these hands can do. Yeah, 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 yeah. So if these hands can do this, yeah. imagine what your mind could do if you study what, what's the bit further. Doing? Sorry? What's stopping us from doing it? What's the purpose? What's, the, what's stopping us from doing it? What's stopping us from doing it? 
if you want the true answer, we're gonna be here all <laughs> night. But the, the, the quickest way I can shorten it yeah. is <laughs> somewhere along the line, we lost our spirit. And that's what I'm saying, that's what westernization is. But we lost our spirit. No, yes. Who said Western people lost their spirit though? Who said they didn't? No, I'm not I'm saying they didn't. I'm saying that we did it as a result of our contact. But why is that westernization? That's not like in so, my in my mind, yeah. I'm gonna call it what it is. What is it? When you lose your spirit, yes. it's because you yourself as an individual yes. did not safeguard it in the first place. There, you cannot look that. anything that. what belongs to you yes. cannot be taken <coughs> unless you just let go. You see, the way power works is it belongs, that's, this is your power. Yeah, yeah. I can't take your power unless yeah. you let me. No, we're in agreement, you know, we're not disagreeing. Yeah. But what I'm saying is, we, we, when, we, when we gave up our power, we replaced it with something. Stupidity. <laughs> I'm not going to deny that. No, no, that, like, but that, but that but, but my point is that that stupidity, yeah, that stupidity keeps, keeps some people strong yeah. and us weak. Yeah, so we are stupid for the sake of somebody else's wealth, for the sake of somebody else's prosperity. So for example, like what, like what you spoke about, like what you spoke about, yeah, Dubai doesn't have certain things, yeah, mm -hmm. but Africa does. Let's just use Nigeria for example, yeah. Um, and let's look at the 70s in Nigeria, whereby um, oil was being extracted for silly yeah. money, yeah? yeah. But that oil was making was ensuring that lights were kept on in Britain yeah. and America and yeah. all across Europe, yeah, right? Now. right? All now. So my, my 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 only point is that it's not that, that, that we're stupid for the sake of stupidity. Our stupidity has a purpose, yeah, and that, that purpose is to make sure that places like this are kept at a certain standard of living. You see what I'm saying? And, and electricity. That's why that's why that's why there's no lights out can I, in, can in I London. Throw, can I throw a spanner in the works? Throw the spanner, sis. Throw the spanner. If you think yeah. that everything we own yes. is keeping this place alive, yes. then we've really lost it. Correct me then, correct me, correct me. Alright, leave this. Leave it, leave it. Now, Jura is powerful, yeah? yeah? We've got a resource. Yeah. But somehow, our resource is not working for us because somebody is taking it. Yeah? No, yeah, but, yeah, but I'm, it's, I'm, it's, that's what's happening, right? Yeah, yeah. So, in order for someone to take what you have, someone's got to be letting them through. Yeah, definitely, yeah. Alright. Yeah. So, who's letting them through? Yeah, we are. Definitely. Okay. Yeah. So, then, it's not now stupidity anymore. What's going on? Like, like, I'm going to I'm, I'm, I'm go, 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 go. Now it's not stupidity anymore. Yeah. Now you know what you're doing. Yeah. But why? Right. Why would you see your people suffer? Right. That is a question. So that someone else yeah. can live better. That is a question. So now, so, so now, what's that? But we're not disagreeing. Sorry. Yeah. But, 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 but you have to understand now. Yeah. What you're not acknowledging in the what you're not acknowledging in the picture is yeah, there is someone. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, in fact, there's a whole bunch of people yeah. that are starving, yeah. living below breadline, not living a standard life. Yeah. Now, somebody has identified the desperation of one of these individuals in the community, yeah, yeah, yeah. and has used it, yeah. used that man's um, short sight, yeah. yeah, and his desperation for his family, yeah, yeah. to capitalize off it, yeah. right, to the detriment of his people. Yeah. So we have to, yeah, that that person, he betrayed his people. He lets it, the, the resources of the land go for a meagre gain, mm -hmm. yeah? But those people, yeah, they know they capitalize on a man's desperation. No, so both are to blame. Definitely. No. Yeah. There's, there's, there's blame in you, both sides. You, you know, yeah, I don't even blame white people. It's not about blaming white people, you know. You it's know, it's the, about understanding what the problem is. Yeah? The, the, look, how many years have we stood in front of cameras, yeah. stood in groups, yeah. workshops, yeah. church? mosque, temples, repeated the same conversation, but not one of us has shifted the kingdom. All right, I'm going to disagree with that. Can it be, can it, the, the, the effort, the, indiv we can, we can can the individual effort that, shift but, but the... You, do you know, you know, you know, how old am I now? I'm, I'm about to turn 24. Yeah. When I was 16, I had the same conversation. 17, same conversation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What, and, don't, and there were people before us that had the same conversation as well. But the difference is this. But, but what we're doing, sorry to yeah, call no, you, no, no, no. is speaking. Yeah. You see, in Yoruba, yes. they say your words, they must manifest. Yeah, definitely. Like it must produce life. Yes, yes, yes. I'm tired. Say it in Yoruba, say it in Yoruba. Don't want to say it. <laughs> <laughs> but either way, like, like your words must produce, they must manifest, yes, yeah? Yes, yes. And all I'm seeing is even powerful black people in high places, Say all this, everyone's talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody's talking. Everyone I see is talking. Yeah. And 
I went to Nigeria two years ago and I saw my dad and I, I, I remember I went to the village and I said to my dad because my dad's very like ah Nikki the Nazis everybody that's, that's how he is and I asked my dad I said dad when are we going to be able to rebuild this country yeah. and he said to me that if you don't do it no one will of course, but and, fact. And, and, and then in my mind, I was like, what do you mean by me? He said, if you, and he called my name from, because I have like seven. Mm -hmm. he called so, so, them, so does my son, by the way. He called them from <laughs> beginning to end. He said, if you, yes. as a spirit, as a vessel, just you on your own, yes. if you don't start shifting, yes. nothing will shift. Yes. Because so many people have come along and said, there's a problem on this land, but nobody has said, I will now go and fight the problem. Right. Now, this, this, is, this is the only place that we, that we have a disagreement here. What? It's on the issue of nobody has, has come and tried to fight the problem. Because okay. many have come. <laughs> yeah, many have come. So, if we're, if we're just talking, like, we have so... My, my dad said something to me one, one time, yeah? He said, we as African people, and he's talking about us globally, mm -hmm. yeah? He's saying, we have had some of the best leaders and movements, yeah, that were sent to any people on the planet Earth. Yeah, yeah but we're doing and, it, right? right, and our people would have, would have done more with them, yeah, by now, yeah. So if we if we just deal with the continent, for example, yeah, if I say the name Patrice Lumumba, if I say the name Thomas Sankara, yeah, and I'm, and I'm mentioning these people mm. because they because they're leaders and heads of states yeah, yeah, who yeah. are in government mm -hmm. who are actively doing things to change situations, yeah. If I say the name, I, I, I mentioned um, I mentioned Lumumba and Sankara and Kruma, yeah, for example. Let's not talk about heads of states. Let's talk about a man like who's one of my greatest heroes, yeah, Fela and Nicola Pocuti. Let's talk about Winnie Mandela, yeah. Let's talk about why, why, yeah. okay, okay, right. Okay. But my point is that my point is that what did they do? Right. What did they do? Because let's break it down. <laughs> wait, wait. Let's break it down. Because remember, remember, go on, go on. what's Fela's legacy? Yeah. What is his legacy? Go. On. No, no. I'm asking you. What's his? What's he yeah. known for? What's he known for? Well, that depends. That depends. Who, who, music. Someone said music. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. No, but but for, for some people. We can sing all day. Yeah, no, 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 no. But Fella did more though. Fella did more than, than, than sing. Yeah, but but let's but let's let's put Fella to one side for a second. I come back to Fella. Yeah, I will defend the legacy of Fella all day, all day. No, all no, day. I'm not right? disputing. No, yeah, 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 no, I'm no. Every night no, is gonna run for no, no. <laughs> <laughs> You better tell them that. I, all I will all I, all I will say all I will say is that he started a thing called the movement of the people, whereby he wanted to run for political office. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and 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 the the, the, the establishment in Nigeria did their best to keep him out um, of, of, of that of that. But see, of that's, that the, that's, my, that's, right? that's, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Everyone thinks that in order to change, yeah. we have to go into politics. Yeah. We have to do this, we have to do that. You, you which, that. which of that, course, yeah. I understand. Yes, yeah. you need to go into politics. Yeah. But if you've tried something yeah. and failed, yeah. tried and failed, yeah. tried and failed, yeah. tried a couple hundred more times and failed, I don't yeah, know if we tried that all, all that time yeah, or not. No, no, no. Every, remember, we were colonized, remember, up until 50, 70 years ago, we were colonized, yeah? So we wasn't even what's, in, 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 um, what, how long, how long have like we been woke for? Because you know everyone's woke now. So we've had periods Wait, of wokeness. Oh, yeah. no, but no, is 50 no. years supposed Wait. to be enough? People, be, these people have, 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 have um, they've built their civilizations, yeah? Over centuries, centuries. you know? Millennia they've had to build up there. And we've had, I heard a man say 24 years. Yeah. So for some people, for example, like if you look at South Africa, which 1994 was when they got rid of apartheid, for example. Just you know what I'm saying, really and truly. My, my only point is that we, you're, you're correct here, yeah, in the sense of the, 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 the emphasis needs to be on us and what we can do. I, I don't want to be correct. Like, like, let me be honest. Me I like her, you know, I'm not no, going to no, lie. No, it's not <laughs> I don't want to be correct. What I really I like want her, I like is her. that I'm a woman, yeah? Yes, sir. When, when me and my sister come and we come and now give yes. children to this land, yes. I don't want them in this. I don't I want the, like, I'm tired of the same, like, I am tired of the same nonsense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because every time I go anywhere and black people congregate, we are so passionate yeah. about the movement. Yeah. We're so passionate to talk about the movement. Yeah. But when I tell my brothers, come, let's sit down, do the business plan now. Let's start moving. Let's start teaching our children ourselves. Let's bring back the Black Wall Street. You know what I'm talking yeah, about? Yeah. Everyone's ghost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you know what? No one's really for. No one's really about truth. Nobody really wants to change. No one wants to deal with their dirty habits. They want to talk about it, but they don't want to do it. When it's time for the action, no one's ready to work. But you see, the thing about white people is. Peter, Paul, Pan, Matthew, everyone's on it. The moment they say, by Monday, yeah. we need to sort something out by Wednesday. Tuesday is done. <laughs> you, black people, let's all go on holiday. 
No, 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 no. But I'm saying it's, it's this, this, like I said, yeah, these people have had a millennia to do. Yeah, yeah. So when you, it's like, the, I've seen so many of the vigils, yeah, when you see a man in a handicapped race, like, a man's been given 50 seconds to, to go in a 100 meter race, he's already got speed, your, 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 your leg's tied to someone else. I'm saying, look, there's so many layers, yeah, yeah. in Africa yeah. that hinder African performance, yeah. yeah. yeah? One of that is the fact that our people are so given yeah, yeah. to corruption. Right, right. Yeah? The fact is, yeah, when you're talking about business and resources and money, yeah. the, bruv, for me, yeah. one of my biggest fears is that I'm going to take money out of my pocket, give it to someone, yeah. and he's going to run away with it. Why? Because I've seen hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of examples yeah, yeah, yeah. of people do that for me. So right. it's now it's trying to build with like-minded people, trying to identify. This is why we do a lot of the talking. Because I, for me, I'm trying to identify people that are like-minded, right. Right. so we can take the step it's forward ideas. together. Right. So do, we, it, do, I, do, I, do I identify a man by the way he speaks? I identify a man by the way he speaks and his actions. How about his spirit? Well, I can't. I, I'm, I don't. I'm not that spiritually inclined. <laughs> yeah. So I can only see what I can only see what you provide to me now you know, and what your energy is like. You know what? Can I'm I, gonna ask something to that? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. What I want to say is this: you know, the only way for people to be proud or to do something for the for black movement, right? Is What's about Africa now? So you can say Africa. You can say Africa. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sorry. Okay. No problem. Thank you. <laughs> Understand them. Yes, 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 yes. Um, the only way we can we can talk about Africa, be proud of Africans, yes. is uh, of the people in, in, in the Western world, or people who are not in Africa, yes. like for us, yes. is that if we fix Africa, or the people, or the politicians of Africa actually become less greedy yes. uh, and uh, less corruptional, then we can be and, and they fix Africa and we and they made it more advanced than the way we, the way media is shown. And let's let those shops, sorry there's just something opposite to what we see in the media, then us, the African descent, would have something to be proud of, and we'll rep that. The reason why, like you pointed out, white people, the reason why white people are doing what they're doing is simply because they have something. They have something to be proud of. Right? But I know we do, we do, we do, we do, but when we look at Africa, our politicians are the ones that are fucking us up. No, no, no. That's we the point, do. though. It's you... not just them. It's no, no, but everyone's, everyone's no, but corrupt. If the leader is, is corrupt, if the head is corrupt, yeah. Yeah, everything else is going to be. But True. to my I'm, point, I'm is, always. I, I, I hear what you're saying. You know. By, no, no, listen, no, no. for me, I agree. Moved by totally. Swords. Absolutely. There's absolutely. nothing else for them. Man. Absolutely. They're meant to right? get head topped. Top. That's it. Absolutely. That's it. Man agrees with that. Head topping. And maybe it's the basket energy right now. Okay. But head topping off the right? No, what's it called? No, but my 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 only issue is 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 the fact that we we should not forget that we had incorruptible leadership, yeah? yeah, we did, yeah. Right, we had incorruptible leadership. And we were in the context of a war in the sense of the fact that we were fighting colonizers, yeah? Who had, who had come, you know what I'm saying this? Because it's a fact, yeah? We can't deny that people came in to fight us and we were fighting back against them. That's a reality. And what I'm saying is that if somebody comes to power, yeah? And, um, and, and they're doing right by themselves, they're doing right by their people. And that person is taken out for whatever reason. It's not because that there's a there's a there's a there's a, a, cor a corruption problem that's exclusive to to you know what I'm saying? Africa. To Africa. The corruption in, in, in Africa comes in a context, yeah, and it's and it manifests in a particular context. There's corruption everywhere in the world. Hundred percent. Right? But, I'm but it's just that our threshold, yeah. A man will sell out his people just for a house and a car. I agree, bro, but that's the that's the condition that, 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 no, we're, that we're in. Trust, well. That's the condition that we're in. Let me ask you something. Yeah, yeah, so, so, you see, in Africa, before the white people came, yes. right, we had our own systematic or political, sorry, we had our own political system yes. that we organized things. Yes. The things that actually messed up the African people yes. and put them in the system, in the system that they are, they are in today yes. is... Uh, they've been forced upon them yes. a system yes. which is not known to them. Right. So some of them are against it and some of them are, are with it because it serves their own personal that's, need. That's, you understand? That's what I'm talking so, about. So basically, yeah. how do we get rid of that? Yeah. The only way we can get rid of that yeah. is simple. Yeah. It's not that simple, but uh, yeah. the wording is simple. It's, right. <laughs> right? it's simple to say it. Yeah, yeah, the wording <laughs> is simple. And that is, 
we should get rid of this system right. that we are in, that we've been system. imposed upon right. and create our own system that's unique and separate to us. Right. Then in that way, right. we can have something that we are in, we are proud of. For example, look at China, North Korea, India. They have their own system. Right. Not so much, not so much about India, but right. talking about China and then other Asian yeah. countries, right? So we what's the first thing they did though? though? What's, 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 just a challenge. What's the first thing they did though? Bloodshed. Yeah. Yeah. Bloodshed. Void. Right? No, but, but before that, they, 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 were, they cleared the colonizers out first. Yeah. Right? And then they said, right, now we've got the colonizers out. We've got to get rid of the colonizer culture. Yeah. yeah? So everybody, and Mao shut down, yeah. shut down all university, yeah. shut down school, shut down everything. Why? Because it was colonial. Go on a rice field, go plant rice. Yeah? yeah? And learn to be Chinese again. Yeah. Right? That's what it was. So, my, my, so this, 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 this is why I say, it's, 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 in terms of a cultural thing, that we're, we're, we're still following. That's, this is why you got an election on the continent and there's 16 people running. And the primary thing is how can we maintain Westminster style democracy? Yeah, right? Seriously, am I lying? Watch any any election taking place in any country on the continent and tell me if but democracy listen, but that's a and big, Westminster style democracy doesn't But that's come. a big thing though. Even though these men, yeah, are, you know they're hella corrupt, yeah. yeah. Do you know what's so deep? People often say, yeah, yeah. that on the, on the comments and that, ah, oh, these men will never live in Africa, yeah. which is a lie. We yeah. love Africa, we go back and yeah, visit. Yeah, yeah. But one of the things that worries me about long-term living yeah. in Africa yeah. is legislation. How easily a man can sell two, like, produce two deeds, yeah. land deeds, yeah, right, yeah? Right, 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 sell it to right, two separate men, yeah. assert the money, yeah. and them men are beef. And then that person, one of them, whoever's got the most wealth, yeah. can put his hand in his pocket, put it in a judge's yeah. pocket, yeah. and then that's that. But so my, I'm saying, this is my thing though, yeah. These people, even though they're corrupt, they have a level of justice which allows their people to yeah. thrive. Yeah? And I'm not gonna lie to you. When I was in Ghana, yeah. 2015 years, yeah. so like this is my first time in the continent, you know what I'm saying? Yeah? First week, I was skipping through the continent. Nothing could bother me, right? And you know, and, and, and a crowd can be a lot. Yeah, it, it, is right? a it's, it's, it's just a lot, yeah. Right? Way, Trust me, like you you'll be walking down the street and every minute somebody's trying to sell you something, yeah? And for the first week I was there, yeah. For the first week I was there, I was like, I was cool to just say, I'm cool, I'm fine, right? You know what I'm saying? Like it's cool, but I'm I'm in I'm in I'm I'm dealing with my brothers in it, yeah. so I'm I'm smiling with them. I'm cool. I'm I'm related to, but it's like I'm good. Thank you very much, but I'm good in it. After about the third week, yeah, it started to get tiring, right? It started to weigh down on man, yeah. And no, seriously, it was it was because and I'm not and I'm not. It, yes, the effort is a lot, but obviously, because I, I I had a good. Um, I got good friends in Ghana as well, so they, I didn't I didn't go there on like you know some tourist mission and I was staying in some five star hotel. For the whole time. I, I went places in it. I went places that my brother Bridget would say to me that most people, most returnees that I even got Ghanaian parents don't go, right? And you're un, I'm understanding the condition of the nation and the country and what is going on. You see what I'm saying? And it's like when you understand these things, I can't blame people for being in a situation whereby it's dog eat dog and we're acting like it. You know what I'm saying? I can't blame the brother who's trying to sell me something that is worth 20 for 100 because I know that he's just trying to feed his family, right? And it's wrong, it might be wrong, but I'm saying, rah, but this is, if I, we, we, now we have to look at the whole situation of the nation, right? The whole economic situation, right? And what is disenfranchising these people from being able to act in a way whereby you know what I'm saying? You know, it's, it's not like that, right? Now, when we look at it, we're seeing what we're talking about right about now. We're, we're seeing that the nation that we have on the continent were borders drawn up for colonial purposes and they're still facilitating those purposes right about now. But they, they, these, these people are still controlling the wealth of these lands. That's what's taking place. So the only way to solve that problem of me having to walk down across the street, no, thank you, bro, I'm good, thank you, rare, rare, is to change the entire economic system of this nation it means it's possible because all it means is that people have to shut down some borders say listen <coughs> you can't trade right here right now yeah we're shutting this down in fact let's stop trading with britain let's let, let's let ghana trade with ethiopia for a sec yeah we got cocoa you got coffee yeah, yeah? ghana yeah. is like their coffee yeah. and, and and ethiopians like their cocoa so let's do some trade Right, you know, you know what I'm saying? It's that kind of stuff that's gonna that's gonna change the situation. But just by doing little things like that, you employ some 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 Ghanaian farmers and some and some Ethiopian farmers, and we're doing some trade because the West is no longer the the focus. Internally, is the focus, and that's that's why I say 
we have to deal with this, the, the, the question of, of, of westernization because part of what's stopping us from being able to relate to each other is because we're all looking outside we're all looking to america we're all looking to britain and now more and more we're looking to china to solve our problems i'm saying do we need to instill some sort of I don't want to say Aryan race ideology into that. No. The, the reason why I say listen, <laughs> no, no, no. The reason why I say that is. I know what you mean, but. The reason yeah, why yeah. I say this is just off the little history that I've done when I was at school. You're right, sister. You're good. Yeah. Just after the just after the Treaty of Versailles, when the when when the um, the Allies tried to put down Germany, yeah, yeah. And put down mad sanctions, yeah, so yeah, they yeah. would never rise up and challenge the British that. Empire. Hitler went, on, point. Hitler went on a one where he's yeah. like, boom. Forget all these people. Right. It's the Jews' fault. Right. Yeah? yeah. Furthermore, we're superior to anyone else. Right. Yeah. Right. Right. So let's galvanize right. each other. If they say they're gonna sanction right. us, bond them. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna yeah. do our own thing, go yeah. through our own austerity, yeah, whatever, yeah, yeah, yeah. raise up our ranks. Yeah. And and then he and then when he done that, he went up badding up yeah, everybody. Europe till he yeah. got to a certain stage right. where he said, nah, nah, right. nah, we've got to, yeah. we've got to do I don't something. want to go too far with the Hitler example <laughs> for obvious reason. But but let, let, let me let me say it now. But I, I get what you mean in terms of in terms of Hitler was focused on economically securing Germany. And I'm saying right? this the people yeah. that were the people yeah. that were economic. Jeez, yeah. 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 That's, 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 put it this way. Put I don't, I'm, I'm not, I'm not I, even, I don't believe. That's, that's to judge I don't believe that he was everything that they say he was. <laughs> but he's not. He's, he's not. An, he's not a guy that I'm, that I'm trying to emulate. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna throw in. But I'm saying, look, you can. You can. You can. You go in, sis. You go in. We're African people. What's your name, sis? This is your little sister. Okay, Nikki. That's for Nikki. What's your Yoruba name? I want to know your Yoruba name. The long one now. It's not just Kiki, is it? It's Kiki. That's it. I thought that was a conversation or something. Okay. Kiki. Right. That's a bit easier. Yo, the reason why I'm saying this, actually, you can you can learn you can learn from certain people. I'm not trying to say Hitler. No, no, I agree with that. I agree with that. I agree with that. It's like Mao. Mao's not a guy who can learn from him. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Even the economic. I'm I'm putting Mugabe the in the ring. Yeah, come on. But the point is this: I'm putting Mugabe in the ring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think yeah, getting right, rid of the, uh, uh, of the modern African system, the yeah. political system, yeah. it's not going to be that easy. No, I agree. And, and the reason why it's not going to be that easy is because the people that represent us don't actually have African passports anyways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they don't even uh, represent African people. They come from outer influences. Yeah, yeah. And they actually work for other people. So they carry their own suitcases yeah, yeah. to come work in Africa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Work they're employed West. by somebody. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. So they're employers. They're the CEO. They're keeping eye, they, they yeah. keep eye on us. Yeah, 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 yeah. So they can do their job. Definitely. You know what I'm saying? That's so it. it's going to be really hard. But that's to what I'm saying. Get rid of the economic traitors. Yeah. I, I have spoke about it for a while, but I'm saying for me, I don't see no other way, yeah, yeah. but a revolution. Fam, head top, got like to get bloody, bro. head top in is gonna have to go on. I don't, I don't see a way around it, but before all that, okay, we're not there yet, right? Right? <laughs> before all that, I'm just saying that there, there's an ideological battle that, that battle that needs to be won, right? You see what I'm saying? In the sense of the fact that just the ideas, yeah, because even the ideas when we start talking about them sound far fetched, man. Like when we say Afri Africa, African unity, the idea that Africa can unite seems so way gone. Like, like people don't, people can't even envisage a continent whereby we communicate in ways that benefit us all. That's what unity means, you know. Really, it's communicating in ways that benefit us collectively, and we can't even fathom the idea of. Yeah, 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 yeah. The South so, African Development yeah, Community, yeah. yeah. You see, when that was like, I was about eight, nine, when that yeah. was like moving. Yeah, and yeah, I yeah. remember learning about it in school. Yeah. But it was like all Southern African countries. So each would it's have like, like, yeah, so each would have like its own um, thing that it would specialize in. At the time, I think Zimbabwe was, um, I think it was food, uh, thing, food surplus, food yeah. storage, and that. And then the other countries would have that. And then when one doesn't have something, the other Someone one will step something. in. And that alone, bro, like I've never seen that pattern ever it's come never, back. It's but never, it never it never it's never benefited. It's never what tried to accomplish. But, it's been done. I, but this is the part <coughs> that we we've had some of the best leaders with all the ideas, yeah? Mm. We don't even study the ideas. Let's just let's, let's look at 50, 70 years, 60, 70 years ago and the ideas of the people of the, the post that like the independence era and what they were dealing with mm. yeah so, some of them disagree with it here and there but generally speaking like you've got a lot of people with good ideas that were in the process of, of, of instituting them yeah, i always like to use the, word, the example of thomas sankara in the 1980s yeah look at his nation burkina faso yeah first of all we got rid of the name upper voter yeah and it named called? it it was called upper voter so this is north of oh, yeah, right yeah, yeah. what's it called and then he renamed it Burkina Faso, which in one of the languages, I can't remember which language, means the land 
of upright people. Yeah, that's what he called it. Yeah, so this is already he's got a, he's got a name that speaks anti-corruption. Yeah, this, we're incorruptible. We're upright people. Yeah, right. And the, the amount of things that he did, but the, the one one example of the funny thing that he did here yeah, was he was able to get the people of the nation here, yeah, and he started it as well, um, to plant over several million trees, yeah, because of, of desertification. Apparently Ethiopia did a similar thing the other day. Um, in terms of planting some of was because of because of a famine or something like that. Yeah. But I'm saying, imagine that from like I'm, I'm, I've heard estimates of between one and three million trees, yeah, because Basically, the, the desert was expanding. They had to do something to fort it, and he had ordinary people, including himself, school children, yeah, army personnel on road, yeah, planting. I'm saying trees, yeah. What's it called? <coughs> a laying railway. There's images of him being the first person to lay the, 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 the to lay the railway thing, right? So I'm saying to, for, for for the nation. My point is that we've had good leaders, Maji. What happened to Thomas Sankara? He was killed. Who killed him? His own friend. His army. Blaise Compore. Right, who was you spoke about in players? Right, he's like uh, close right, friend, close friend, Blaise yeah. Compoire, yeah. who uh, was only overthrown a couple of years ago yeah. in, in, in Burkina Faso, yeah. but he was funded and assisted by the French and the British. And you know, funny enough, right? that guy he trusted him so much, so much, so much, like, 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 like they did everything together. And then at everything. the end of the day, They're, even their parents know each other, yeah. And weirdly enough, as soon as they, they killed him, he became a president, he became the president, <laughs> right? But, but apparently. Now, this is the, the, the thing. Apparently, there was a because the, the plot to, to kill um, Sankara was known, and people came to Sankara and said to him, "Well, why, why, this guy? You have to deal with this guy over here." Get me. So, Sankara said, "Listen." I'm not going to break the friendship, innit? Yeah. Oh. If it was like, it's a deep I situation. That's, that's, that's yeah? that's but that's my point is that, you know what I'm saying? My point is that there is no Blaise Campari without a France and a Belgium and it backing him. There's no, it doesn't exist. Because they kept him. It's like after, after when they killed Namumba, um, um, uh, Mobutu was kept in power for 30 odd years. Yeah, he, they, they, there was no way he could have done that. Yeah. Because, look, think about this. When um, um, Namumba was killed, um, Mobutu is in power. There's a thing called the Simba Rebellion, yeah, led by a, a brother called Pierre Mulele, yeah, and some others, yeah. Simba Rebellion and, and, a few, and a couple of other rebellions. But they were they were able to take back about half the Congo. The Congo is the size of Western Europe, yeah. They had a rebellion against Mobutu that was able to take back half, nearly half the Congo, yeah. Simba Rebellion, right? It's a complex story, right? But that's the point. The point is that they were fighting against this so-called dictator, yeah? But what keeps the dictator in power? The support that he gets from the West. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's, what, that's what always happens. These dictators are supported by these people. When Mugabe was a, was a, was a Western darling, yeah, coming to, coming to Britain, yeah, and, what, and, 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 his, and his government ministers were waltzing with, with, um, with, with Maggie Thatcher, they were in love with my man. Right? They were in love with my man. But as soon as, he, as, soon as the, the war veterans took take land, and he, instead of, if, if, if Mugabe at that point had said, you know what, fam, I'm sending police, I'm sending army for these guys, yeah, and we're going to mold them down, Today, Mugabe would have be a beacon of democracy. Mm. There'll be a statue to him mm. outside Parliament, like that, like, like there is Mandela, mm. right? You know what I'm saying at the moment, that's, that's what would happen. Mm. But now, nah, man said, you know what? I'm gonna back these guys right now. Mandela, Mandela told the line, yeah. Mandela <laughs> told the line. <laughs> Mandela told the line. That's, that's, that's the reality. That's the reality. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't take, I don't take yeah, away. Uh, I don't think Mandela is like uh, Mandela's not as uh, as heroic as we make him appear. You know that he but listen, I'm I just not, got, I'm not going to take away from Mandela what is due to Mandela. I'm not going to props to a man who, who sat down for 20 years plus but yeah, but for his thing, innit? Yeah. Mugabe, Mugabe was in jail for like 11, yeah? You know what I'm saying? And and <laughs> this is this is this is one strike that I have with Mandela, yeah? Because Mandela wasn't the only person to do, to do that kind of a stretch in jail. And there were people, when he came out, that were freedom fighters that were still in prison when he was the president, yeah? And to me, Mm. That is unacceptable. Yeah. That's unacceptable. And he had the ability to free them? He's the president. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right? if, if you can get free... They, 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 there, were, there were people that were still in jail, like prison, yeah, for, for, for being freedom fighters in South Africa when man was still the president. There are people... In fact, there are people that are still in prison all now, up until... I, I don't know if, no, I mean, you know what, that, but up until very recently at least. Yeah, because there were still campaigns yeah. for people to be they released might not be, from they prison. They might not be wired right in that door, though. Mama just, I, the freedom on the people, they just go all out in that. Like, you know, no, no. Nah, nah. But, 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 but again, again, um, the, the, the ANC government is heavily backed by the West. 
Tories. Yeah, heavily. Because they know that the, the, the ANC government is the difference between all-out revolution mm -hmm. in South Africa and apartheid. Mm -hmm. Yeah, again. Yeah. You know what, what I'm saying? Is, what, what party is Malema in? EFF. But he was ANC. Oh, he okay. was ANC Youth League and he was causing problems, so he left. That in, in charge, that's that's why I say we can't that's that's that's, that's that's why I say we can't say that, we can't say that no one's doing anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's what I say. And, and I'm saying like and, and, and for me for me, you know? for me this is this is come back to this come back to um to Raven and, and the Black Bet thing. For me, yeah, we can have all these conversations. See a man with a berry is on the action. But my thing is if we're if we're in London, yeah. With all the levels of, of, black, of, of blackness in Africa that we have here, and we can't, like, why can't we be a, a microcosm, yeah, of what the continent can do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see what I'm saying? Like, but we're here now, innit? We're talking we're about exhibit. the leaders and whatever, whatever, but, <coughs> but we're here right now. But we are a microcosm, because outside yeah. of the issues which are in Africa, yeah, we are exhibiting them here. We're carrying out. We're carrying, we're carrying you over. You mean we're, we're, we're a microcosm of the, of the negative? Of the negative, right. Right, 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 right. right so right. all the things that are spitting us up, man calling themselves semitic and hemetic and right, 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 whatever right. here, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> it's real though. That, 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 these are things that, that are causing division. Mm. Like whether one is semitic or not, mm. whether one is Bantu, whether one is Negro, mm. or whether one is Afro-Asiatic. Mm. And we never gave ourselves none of these terminologies. Mm. Where did we get them from? Mm. Someone Sorry, my brother. I'm not going to go down. But I'm saying, yeah. what I'm oh, saying wait, is, wait, wait. Yeah. I have to correct you there, though. Go, go, go. Because at the end of the day, um, the wordings mm. are English and yeah, Western yeah. and alien to us. That's yeah. true. But at the end of the day, prior to us being calling ourselves these words, we had our own word that we called ourselves. We did. Yeah. How do you say, how do you say Afro Asiatic in Somal? I don't know. I'm not going to tell you something, but maybe no, there's but a word No, but his point is, they would have been but Somal. They would have just been the Somali. tribes. They wouldn't have been calling themselves yeah. Asiatic. But, 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 but at the end of the day, look, the in Somali, oh, in, in Horn of Africa, as Somalis, for example, the Arabs, before, yeah. uh, in Arabic, because of the, so, Somalia was known as Berber, right? Or, or stretching from, uh, what was it called, northeast all the way to, uh, half, what was it called, central, <coughs> central Sahara, yeah. was known as the Berber land, you yeah. understand? Yeah. And we were seen as one people, as the Berbers. Yeah. But then as time passed, um, the Berbers are apparently Arabs. I must uh, say, sorry, though, Arab. the Arabs are very lazy in their designation of They are, they my, are, but the reason, why they, the reason why they call us that <coughs> is because at the end of the day, now if we look at genetics, <coughs> they happen to be correct because the, uh, the Berbers and the Somalis have the same genes. But coming back to the point, is that we already had these wordings in our own ways, but it wasn't just written, it wasn't written, I don't know about that, and man. it wasn't documented. I must say, my brother looks Chris that, today as well in his no, African garb. We're trying, we're trying, you know? We're doing thing, you know? It just so happens, it just so happens that the uh, English words that we use to classify ourselves have been documented. You understand? So, um, it, it, for example, Arabs were always known as Arabs, right? Uh, Ethiopians were always known as Abyssinians, or, or maybe Aksumites or whatever. So there's a lot of ways that we can classify ourselves in African terms. I mean, we had these names, but we didn't fight. Like, I, I don't think like the amount. I don't well, use Somalis, the word fight, but like, I, I don't think the amount food. of hate we had for I'm each not, other. I'm not denying not the, the fact that we had people groups and all. Yeah, we, we, no, did. we, we did. And, 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 and through migration. There's always been war in Africa. Yeah, there's always been. But the amount of hate we had people groups. But all I'm saying is, a lot of the designations that we're going under at the moment are not indigenous to us. These are not designations that we define for ourselves. Oftentimes, we're dealing with European anthropologists who come and put names on people. You know what I'm saying, right? And, and you know, when it comes to uh, like pride and you know feeling superior, mm. other, other ways, you know, these things, it was in Africa, all, yeah. right? For example, in the Fulanis felt like they were better than other Africans, whereby you have the house of Dango. And, no, no, no. You get into things there. You get into things there. It's touch on the West now, bro. Come on, my mum say that Fulani thing is as a result of Arab imperialism. I can't, I can't. Listen, let me finish, yeah? I can't keep speaking about Somali this, Somali that. I have to come sometimes go to the other side. Of I agree, I agree, bro. We agree, we agree. So, yeah. <laughs> we agree. So at the end of the day, you have the Hausa who feel better than the Fulani. Or you have the Yoruba who went like, you know what, we were the stars of the... No, no, I, I hear that. I, 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 but so we, we, we had these things. It's not like the white people or the Arabs brought, brought this shit up. It was already there. That's, you know? Mm. It's just the yeah. wordings. Well, 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 we're dealing with something like that. Whether it's, whether it's there in a small element yeah. and then it's exacerbated. Right, right, right. And they yeah. put a catalyst in there right, right, and it right. erupts and then men start right. all out it's killing men. So right. we, ha we have what no. happened in Rwanda with the, with the hooks <laughs> and the tootsies. Maybe they were different. Maybe they acknowledged their differences. But then a man came up and said, Rah, do you know what? 
Forget the differences. Yeah. The brother that's taller than you, he's got all the all the yeah. resources. He's yeah, got all yeah, the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It changes. We got to look at it, fam. And then they start murking each other over that. You know, you know, you know when Islam came to Somalia, like yeah, that was in the seventh century. Islam kept growing in Somalia, and there was a junk of Oromos as well on parts of Somalia. And so at that time, uh, the Oromos and Somalis had the same gods. We had like used to worship idols and stuff. So long story short, um, the Somalis the started days, yeah. giving. Refuge to Allah. At some point, at some point, you know, you know the name Gal. That's a Somali term. And the Somalis start giving the Oromos a certain term to discriminate against them because they didn't believe in Allah. Right. So they start calling them Galo. Right. right? That's why you have the uh, the Gala people. <laughs> right? But I know they're trying to English, that's, that's the, Latin, like the Latin version of it. Yeah. But the Gala is a Somali word meaning Gal, which means. Uh, uh, um, Oh, what's the other word? Arab Infidel. 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 Infidel, yeah, infidel. That's what he means, right? But at the end of the day, that's why they, that's the classification, right? So um, at some point, when before Islam came to Somalia, right, there was a tension between the Gala, the Oromo, the Somalis, and the Habasha, and they had they had different names to you know discriminate against each other. So at the end of the day, this this things even in Europe. I mean, now they don't do it. it. Deep down, they don't like each other. But for the sake of, you know, yeah, they keep do you know, yeah, yeah. know what they've done? They've yeah. done away with tribalism. That's it. Yeah, they have. Yeah, These yeah, people, that's, that's let's, let's be real. Well, where did that they change? have, they have no lineage no more. Lisa, but where, the last of the people that had lineage, yeah, were the cops and the picks, and, yeah. and they're the now. Celtics, well, they're, they're, yeah, the Scots and you get, you get them and the Welsh these, and the Irish. There's still friction going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where, yeah, yeah, yeah. where did that take them? Though, look, look at the white people now. What's their culture? What's their heritage? Their culture is, yeah, they can live in their lands, yeah, safe, yeah, without a map. Look, look at, let's look at their culture is capitalism. Their culture is is Westminster democracy, right, and them kind of things there, which they ship to the world. Their culture is 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 um is globalization and and these kinds of things where, whereby they go to the world and they and they and they promote themselves through their television programs and their media. Yeah, but at the same and time, this, this is the Western the culture. Time, brother, what you need to understand yeah. is that they're going to Africa and Arabian countries, copying their culture, even yeah. sometimes claiming a history that's not even theirs. Yeah, so where did that take them? Me, but I look, can never claim someone else's but, history because I know who but, I am. But look at this here. They they went to other countries, yeah, and they saw welfare. What did they do when they saw welfare? They extracted welfare yeah. and they bettered it, right? Okay. So, and they made the system so that their own people, generally speaking, yeah, that yeah, they minimise the suffering that man could go through. So even if you, you know, man's got benefits and you, you might not be able to to pay your bill this month or there's, whatever. There's, there's a they still got a little, yeah, a little yeah, mercy saying. on you. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a single mother. You got a child. You could go to the council yeah. and she. Scared. Who's hearing that in Africa? In Ghana? No, there's no Who? There's what? No you open your legs to go have a baby? No, 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 yeah, yeah, Come. Yeah. That's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying, I'm not, listen, I'm not glorifying them, but I'm saying yeah. they've set themselves yeah, up right, in a way, right. yeah, where they can live comfortably, yeah. yeah, and they thought about their children's generations ahead of them. It's spiraling out and of that's, control that's, now. That's why this Brexit thing at the moment is such a, so much of a problem. Because effectively, they're trying to reverse yeah, a yes. situation in, a, in an economic climate that is not vi where, in which is not viable in the sense of the fact that they want to separate from a, from the European Union, whereby but they the, get all the benefits. Right, we to, but keep the benefits of yeah. it of being a unified block. <coughs> you know what I'm saying, and they, they're, they're struggling to figure out how how the hell to do it. You know what I'm saying, whereas. We ain't even having that conversation. Well, I can't say we're not having a conversation, sport, right? I mean, because it's, because, it's, because it's, we, we, we yeah, give, yeah. Give, give credit where credit is due. Yeah. Um, this this, this um, free trade agreement that was just signed the other day yes. is, yeah. is, a, is, a, is a useful step forward. I've got my issues with it and, and the content that it comes in because... Content over everything From your government and yeah. Man, say it straight. Man, don't listen to BBC. Man, don't listen to ITV. Free. Listen, I don't listen to BBC. I 